good morning long time no see still around just that no content <laughs> so after a long time today we are at Kota Varisan heading to PD first time never cycled to PD before it'll be about 100 km in total right so yeah very early today I'm gonna start early and hopefully we can finish early as well just five of us now let's go Pot Dixon let's go man morning yes I'm still around I still cycle it's just that over the past few weeks I didn't go to any new new routes basically it's um, training for the upcoming uh, TT Ultra <laughs> so that's why I didn't like uh, you know do any content that's just seems like I'm open for like nothing new yeah but I still cycle on average around 80 to 100 uh, kilometer a week and then uh, I've been planning to go to Portixon for quite a while now my initial plan was actually you know to cycle off from uh, Kajang Lekas to Seremban then from uh, Seremban to Portixon then Portixon back to Seremban and take the KTM back unfortunately the that plan cannot realize because apparently we cannot bring our bikes into the commuter from Saramban to Kajang right the only uh, route you know, commuter where you can bring your bike into the commuter is from uh, Tanjong Malim to Port Klang so from Saramban to Kajang unfortunately I'm not able to do so so that's why I actually scrap off that plan. That's from Kajang via Lekas to Saramban PD back to Saramban. So it's around 100 km. All right. If you are to cycle from Kajang to PD and back, uh, I think that will be a lot. Easily 160, 170 km. That will be right? I haven't done one yet. <laughs> Maybe future plans. But today, um, yeah. So from Kota Warisan to Fiji via all these kampong roads that we are heading to. Yeah. It's gonna be chill, right? Alright, so if you have uh, been to Pellet before or been to uh, Bore, wire cotton Bore Sun. We are using the same road, right? At the cotton Bore Sun traffic light, we turn left, and then I think there will be another traffic light up front, the T junction. Probably we will turn right and uh, head towards the Pekan Sepang. And then after that, there will be a junction to Port Lison. From there, you can actually go to Sungai Pelag as well. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll be taking that route. Now we have entered Salak Tinggi. It's a very nice uh, kampong road here. If you have watched my last ride to uh, Sungai Pelek, we actually come through this, this road as well. Yeah. Here, just go all the way straight until the Nagri Sabilan Junction. Okay, 
ra ngoài là phương thân sản lập hành nghị The last trip Nó sang ra ngoài kia I was a morning morning market ngoài kia Which makes the The whole road Very Jam Heavy traffic But today No morning market Probably because it's right eh? Yeah, why not take a break? Okay. Now we are at this uh, long stretch of street. About 8 km to the next turn. Slight improvement on the road. But it's not complete, it's not fully done up yet. Right. Still construction going on. It gets pretty narrow. The road condition is not not the best, but wider boat. Okay, we have reached Pekan Setang, now turn left. It's to Fordison, go straight, it's to Sasan. So, I think this is will be our first stop for pictures before we continue our way to Lukut Okay, 20km in we have reached No, I haven't reached Bodison <laughs> This is just the border I think Yeah, in another 30km to Bodison Koto is 50km Bodison waterfront, 50km back to Kota Warisan Yeah, so a short photo session before we continue our journey to Bodison Right now, all right after the turn, after that, uh, I don't know, Fordison border or something, <laughs> there will be a climb, up and down, up and down, not that bad, Origin, I think probably can go up to like 6-7%, yeah, so now just uh, chill, easy pace, still a long way to go, it's just 20km in, total is about 80km, Alright, another 30 to uh, for Dixon. So don't stress your your legs up too much. Yeah. Because uh slow and easy pace will do. So the last time when I use this road, we turn right. This time we're going straight. So here is Chua. Oh. Who is Chua? So far by Ho Kampong Mei Mang Chua. Chua. Chua Wu Nei. Okay. So this is my first time at this road. Okay, right after all those climbs, then there's descent. This looks pretty fun. Just all the way straight. If we descend all the way down, later we got 10 km to climb, man. Please don't descend all the way down. Bukit Pelangdo Okay Another 6 km to go Okay, Kampung Baru Tanah Merah More palm oil plantation No canopy man The roads are still nice Okay, right now we are already in Lukut Lukut I think is considered for different than sea right? So now heading to our waterfront About 7km To waterfront Let's have a quick breakfast We fill up Before we head back to Kota Warisan 
it's just past 8 it is good we are early all right so heading back later hopefully no sunburn 7 km to waterfront i think that's good oh so look good this look good look good it's not for the okay fine fine <laughs> another 7 km to go to pd okay look good this look good look good it's not pd okay yep we are almost there saw the sign already friends getting excited look good is look good look good is not pd okay i go pd now <laughs> pd straight all right selamat datang ke port dixon oh yes nice ah. so selamat datang ke port dixon means now it's port dixon lah right oh yeah at last we are already in port dixon now making our way to waterfront grab breakfast take some pictures before uh, heading back All right, we did it. So from Kota Warisan to here, it's already about 42 km. Very nice view, right? Oh yes. After 47 km, <clears throat> finally. Yes, we did it. Waterfront. Oh, this is fantastic, man. You know the feeling when you reach your destination is very short. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yes. The feeling of reaching your des destination. Oh, yes. Oh yes, after about 47 km, finally we are here. PD Waterfront, yes, finally one of the bucket list check. Usually with the coast we go like Morib, this time we are in PD man. <laughs> nice, okay, uh, pictures and then breakfast. Right, so the last time I come to the waterfront was during Chinese New Year. I bring my girls. Yeah, this time, finally, I cycle over here. Look at this man. Alright, so we're gonna have a quick breakfast before we uh, head back to Kota Warisan. Let's not waste too much time here. Okay, now we just chill at this uh, cove coffee house. Very nice view. View only nice, huh? Only view. Yeah, view only nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Breakfast. That's like a video. Nothing much, ah. <laughs> Should have go, <laughs> mama. Oh, yeah, never mind, lah. Never mind, lah. But good view, ma. Good view. Good view. Okay, ma. Good view. Okay. Good view. Okay, good view. <laughs> For the view, ah. Okay, lah. <laughs> Not every time we come here, ma. Long, long time once. Okay, lah. Okay, lah. Very nice. Very nice. Lah, you go for your chore. Okay, so after our short breakfast, now back to Kota Warisan. It's about 50 km to go. Let's do it because we're gonna do a couple of stops. <laughs> or heading back, you know lah. <clears throat> Once we reach, reach the destination, then heading back, back to the starting point. Sure, feel a little bit lazy one lah. Normal lah. <laughs> but let's go. Okay. 
heading back past Lokut already back to the Trang Road and the fast bike, the fast bike. all those are uh, all come and to Sepan from here on I think it's about 30 km to Sepang Town not even 10 a.m. super hot man recharge yeah this good day charge plus kick cap 40 km to go and then yeah we'll just go back man okay stop break we feel done now continue all the way to uh, Pekan Sepang yeah about 20 km to Pekan Sepang let's go man I'm gonna be up down up down pretty hilly and the worst thing is no canopy the worst one let's see where to go let's go man super hot still have to get back about 33 km to go yeah, a little bit of climbing to do before it's all flat a little bit of climb torturing okay I think we're done with all the climbs now should be downhill all the way to Pekan Sepang Oh. Alright, so heading back Once you've reached uh, Bukit Kelandu yeah, That's the fun part Majority is a uh, descent It's pretty nice So now a little bit of canopy When you reach here You know that you are reaching Pekan Sepang already Yeah With all these trees Good canopy man it's super hot it's only 10.30 damn okay back to Pekan Sepang already so the last 20 km to go back to Kota Warisan just gonna regroup here wait our friend 10.30 back to Pekan Sepang last stop I think Whew. Have shell now. Regroup and back to Kota Warisan now. Super hot man. 10 30 is super hot. Oh my god. Shower myself. Need, definitely need the shower. Press first before I head back. See. My god. Okay. Done with a quick shower. I need to have that shower man uh, Much better Continue 25km to go Timing is actually good Just that No clouds man No shades at all Sun's super hot uh, Let's go 25km head back Okay Last and final stop at Petronas F1 circuit <laughs> before we head back to Kota Warisan. Another 10 to 12 km to go. We are done. Ooh, super hot man. My god. Shower again. Okay. Almost home. One roundabout. Super hot. I'm burning. I got. Finally, we are back. We are back. Finally. Super hot. 
We are back. That's it. Yum yum, chowfee yam bang. Super hot. I got sunburn already. Confirm. <sighs> That's it, man. Hydrate. <sighs> Safe. Let me take a break first, and then I'll talk. Oh my god, hundred km done. Finally, super hot, man. My god. Actually, the pace was okay, right? And our time was good. It's just that, oh, the sun no good lah. The sun, <laughs> the sun make us oh, feel like giving up so many times, man. And then so because of the sun, we have to stop multiple times because really have to go to the petrol station to cool down. Yeah, just sprinkle, not sprinkle, shower with water, man. <sighs> yeah, but that's it. Right, finally, we did it. Uh, one of the bucket lists you know, to cycle to PD. Yeah, we started from Kota Warisan <clears throat> all the way to PD. 100km return, 50km go, 50km back. Like I mentioned earlier, my initial plan was actually, you know, to cycle from uh, Lekas to Seremban and then take the commuter back, right, KTM. But unfortunately, we can't do that. <laughs> so we cannot take the KTM from Seremban to Kajang, unfortunately. So that's why instead, um, we, we went to this route. But it's, uh, it's actually a very nice route, right? Uh, tarmac is good, road is good, surface is perfect and you start early in the morning, not many cars yeah. so yeah that's it I mean if you want to go to PD, try it out it's a very nice route, I'll share it in the description below so I'm still cycling around, just that lesser content I'll be joining the uh, TT Ultra so next week we'll be back to uh, uh, Hantu Paras Reverse Hantu. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you.